Papa, un, dos. Little bit quicker. What's the most crazy or even random thing that I can try in Spain? How about flamenco? I don't know why I did that. <laughs> If you don't know what flamenco is, it's a Spanish dance that was inspired by flamingos. Wait, is that even right? I knew I was right. And yes, I could have learned to do flamenco in London, but I'm heading to Seville, which is where flamenco was born. Torrential rains and wind, and it's a two hour drive. And whoever I've spoken to so far has said, maybe just skip this class, but I didn't leave my boring job as a wedding photographer to not, to not try new things. And today I'm going to learn flamenco. Yes. Oh, wow. That's not just my bad camera work. That's actually the shaky road. We center, where am I? Oh, and Maria, oh, save me. What's going on? This is supposed to be a sunny country. Wow. Hola. Pues bienvenido a la clase de flamenco. Eh, lo que vamos a hacer son cosas de introducción, de las palmas, del ritmo, un poquito del movimiento. No, I think we have a problem. Maria, do you speak English? I do. Oh. Yes, I thought it was going to be a completely different video. I was thinking, how am I going to even start? Because uh, all I know is seeing and gracias. Like this, make a fist, turn around, let it go. Do I, oh, it's like, like this. Like this, make a fist, mm -hmm. turn around. Okay, one hand goes to my waist. So not here, but here, you know? Okay. Do as a man would do. Put it here and maybe catch it and take it a little bit to the back. Not too much, but you know, you stretch the side of your body. Keep it here. Head up. That's exactly the position that I want you in. Polito and me are brothers from now on. I'm going to do Polito's pose. Yes. The, the thing is, it, it kind of has to, uh, to, to do like vacuum. And so, you need there. That's the one. That's the sign that you need. You see? Now, pose to the middle. is clapping. Standing very upright because you need your 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 strength together to be able to react. Uh, boom, come in. Yes. Okay, wait. So this is my technique. This is after like six videos and not going to the gym for a while. So we're going to do the tuck in and lift. Yes, that. Okay. You, you have to be bold. It's like very impolite, like barging in, kicking in the door. You know what? To my children, I might do that from now on. Go to your room. <laughs> <laughs> flamenco is flamingo. It's based on the flamingo. No. Okay. No. Google, you are wrong. Do you know all that information I told you earlier? No. Delete it. We're going to get it from Maria. No. Flamenco, uh, well, I, I know that that isn't true at all. Some say it comes from the word Pela Mengu. They say that it's a peasant who lost everyone, everything. There's people who think that, but um, those were the ones who were against Franco uh, and used the, the, uh, wanted to use the peasants and the flamenco and the gypsies for their fight against Franco. So that okay. might be a little bit tainted there. Okay. Yeah. So this means right. So. So. so I kick and hit at the same time? No, somebody okay. else claps for you. you know, the singer is the most important because everything started with the singing as an expression of sorrow and misery. Well, uh, I might have to put some other random song on this because this might be copyrighted. <laughs> <laughs> There were uh, curved swords, okay. very beautiful, very dangerous because you could do like this and behead somebody with it, okay. right? Yeah, and afterwards, a lot of the gypsies had one. Once flamenco that was started pre-flamenco time, without the word flamenco, started in about 15th, 16th century, okay. and it got to get the name in the 18th century. So they wanted to define the gypsies without defining them, and most of the gypsies had a Fle Flemish sword. Una rabaja flamenca. Ah, okay. So flamenco means Flemish. Flamenco means Flemish. One, two, three, and stop. Papa, un, dos. Yes. In the development of flamenco, when the rest of the people kind of got filtered out because they got killed, 
persecuted, okay. left, converted to Christianity. Yep. Most of the gypsies were the ones that developed Flamenco later on and have it now in the clue to their society. Like there are songs that we don't do on stage because it's only family. Okay. So there are songs that you never will see unless you're in a gypsy family party a christening. That would have been uh, awesome if I found myself a gypsy family. Yeah. Listen to the song. The yeah. Difficult. <laughs> Difficult. Yeah. It's really difficult. That's something that you normally uh, have to be here for lots of years and be in flamenco to be able to. I be have an idea. We have a Maria. Maybe Maria can set us up because we're here for like a few hours. Maria, is that possible? <laughs> Come on, Maria. No, I don't, I don't have. <laughs> Today, I'm wanting to go to maybe I could squeeze you in, but I don't. Okay. It's the same as that. So, I'm gonna have my diva moment. Yes, it's very good. Let's go. Let's not lie to each other. Most men, when they dance, they're kind of stiff. Yeah, and this, this is good. This is so. If you're a stiff, you know what? This doesn't sound right. Okay, <laughs> I meant stiff as like <laughs> stiff. upright. Okay, military upright. upright. Yes, if you're military upright and you, you you people say you don't have any rhythm, you know you can't really move. They say no. Yes, flamenco might be for you. Yeah. Well, Maria made that so much more fun than I thought it was going to be. And guess what? I had a private class. Yeah. No one else decided to come because I don't know. It sounds like the rain has stopped now. Yes. I'm not walking outside. Marie's going to tell me places to go and find food. Yes. Yes. All right. <laughs> Flamenco. I did the hand again.